Hi, I'm George Cow, and here's my sweet little dog, Buddy. Buddy! <laughs> Today, in this video, I want to talk about motivation. Do you know what are the top way or ways to motivate yourself to do things? Every, I mean, there's so many personality types um, among human beings, and not, you know, some people might say, well, the way to motivate yourself is to get an accountability partner. Other people say, well, the way to motivate yourself is to, is to publicly share your, your goal um, so that you kind of have a lot of people watching for you to complete a particular project. Um, other people say, no, the, the, the way to motivate yourself is to do regular visualization. Well, my answer to this is it depends on your personality type and the way to really find out is to experiment with different ways of motivating yourself and then trying a bunch of different ways and then, and then evaluating, okay, which ways work. Okay, so what I did was I had uh, a bunch of people apply to be my clients, to be part of my coaching program. And in my application, I listed 13 ways to motivate oneself to get things done. And I asked my applicants to score each of those ways based on their knowledge of themselves. And so I want to share with you the top three ways that came back, as well as the, the bottom way. And uh, I will uh, put a little bit of notes on all 13 ways in the notes attached to this video. The top three ways were, number one, connecting to the big picture. So if you're having a hard time or whenever you need more motivation to get a particular project done, to connect that project to the bigger why. Why is that important for your business? Why, why is it important for your life? What difference will it make? How will it create a life that you're really excited about or avoid a problem that you're really uh, scared of? Okay, so that's number one way is connecting to a big picture. Second way was to um, get uh, an accountability partner, a daily or weekly accountability buddy where you're checking with them either via email or via the phone on a weekly or daily basis, or it could be like twice a week. And it could just be short calls, like 15 minutes to 30 minutes where you are reporting to each other on how did it go since your last call on making progress on the thing that you said you were going to make. Um, if you did it, celebrate. If you didn't, what did you learn? How can you do it differently before the next call, etc.? And then the third motivational way was to regularly write your top priorities. So either every morning or at the beginning of the week to write down what are, for example, the top three priorities for you this day or the top three priorities this week to write it down. Um, the, 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 the losing motivational method out of the 13 uh, that I had people score was sharing a goal publicly. This is surprising to me because that has been one of my top motivational methods. That really gets me to do something. When I say to my audience, I'm going to deliver something by a certain date, I tend to get it done. But uh, a lot of my uh, audience members, they themselves don't find that motivational. Maybe they find that too, um, too intimidating or um, yeah, too, too self-defeating perhaps. So uh, I welcome you to comment below this video. Let me know based on your own understanding of yourself, what motivates you to get a difficult project done? Something that you've been procrastinating on perhaps or has the potential for procrastination. What do you do to make sure you uh, give you a better chance of getting it done? And then I'll share with you all 13 methods below. All right, uh, looking forward to your comments and until the next video, I wish you well.